Where's the uh, Where's the other mic, man? What are you doing with it? It's um. I think you have you touched up your butt. Yeah, it's up your butt. All right. All right, Pig and Whistle, we know we go music to comedy, comedy to music. Tonight, right now, you will hear the funniest comedian you will hear in the, in the, all night. Put your hands together for Gretchen Conlin. Ha <laughs> <laughs> I'm the only one. <laughs> Can you come play the, the, the box up here for me too? <laughs> what box do you mean? Uh, ha ha, again, ha ha, cool. <laughs> what about a Rubik's Cube? <laughs> Rubik's Cube? Yeah. I'm gonna start calling it a cube. I got Anybody know how to play the Pubix Cube? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I love, I love uh, yeah. puns. Uh, I don't know, was that, was that the one? He left, uh, the, the, it went out for us comics uh, about birds or for jokes or for, what did he say? I missed the meaning apparently because I'm a comedian or whatever and <laughs> I guess I'm cynical. I don't know what the, what's the difference between musicians and comics. It's like we lack emotions or, or I, don't, I don't know. Somebody enlighten me, I don't know. I can't feel it. No, I, I'm on both ends of the spectrum. I'm a Pisces, everybody. I'm Pisces. Woo! My birthday's the 25th of this month. What night is that? Tuesday? I don't know. I yeah. don't care. But sure. let's let's celebrate. Is my point. <laughs> <laughs> now, let's start now. Um, I was thinking, like, guys grow beards sometimes as a form of protest. I don't know. Is, is, am I wrong? Um, is that? Or at least that's an excuse that they use because they're like, yeah, it's for a reason. And what if it's just because they don't want to shave and they're lazy? Like, like I can't not wash my hair for like a month and say, well, I'm protesting, can I? Can I? I'll try it. Try anything. Um, so I was thinking um, another thing. I don't know. This is a segue from musicians, but I, I uh, updated my profile today on my Facebook. Well, how is it different from yesterday? But everybody's updating their profiles, but I updated my music to say uh, my music interests are soft rock, hard rock, and bar rock. Because <laughs> that makes us political. And music. I don't know. How am I going to know when my light's up? Okay. Um, I'll let you know. Paying attention from the corner. <coughs> oh, you don't think of that's a different kind of um, light. Um, speaking of enlightening, uh, when I go on a walk, I go to Griffith Park. I don't know if anybody's been to Laurel Canyon, but I get I get really annoyed by all the people with their dumb like dogs. Well, the dogs and the names of the dogs are really. You know, this lady walking by, crunchy, come on, crunchy, and this was so annoying, and so I decided to, to have a fake dog name, and I was with my friend, and I was like, hey, check this out, and so we get up to a group of people, and I go, my face, come on, my face, come on, my face. <laughs> a lot of different reactions, but usually people don't laugh like that. Like, what she say? One time I, I met this person, his name was Sam, and sometimes in my head I think of like retarded stuff, and I was like, man, I hope this guy, I hope he says his last name is Francisco. And he didn't, he didn't say Francisco, he said Diego. <laughs> was not as let down as if he would have said. <laughs> What's another weird place? Sam, Sam, Santa Monica? Sam no, Miguel. Here in Diego. San Fernando? Venus? It's like three words. 
San Juan San Luis Obispo. Yeah, that one. No, that Juan one. Capistrano. Yeah, that one. Yeah. Yeah. San Juan Capistrano. I like that place. See, I can never do that in my jokes. I'll forget the name and I'll yeah. really screw it up because I don't even know what it's up to. <laughs> <laughs> I've noticed that something that comics like to do recently, I don't know if it's always been this way, but they'll start to tell a story and it's kind of funny, but they don't have an in for it, and so they'll say, that needs a punchline. And it works, they get a laugh. <laughs> so I'm just gonna start telling shitty stories and say, working on the punchline. <laughs> I'm just gonna come out and tell half ass premises and <laughs> stand with a fake punchline and sinker. There's like a stare at Anthony. I was gonna take my pants off while you're doing <laughs> so excited. But I decided to do this first. Thank you. And then if that doesn't work and you go extra, then I'll take my pants off to you. I'm going to take hers out. Go extra, push it. <laughs> I, I don't know how to react. <laughs> um, someone, I always like to throw in a nice sweet joke. Uh, someone commented on my legs once. Uh, they are like, those legs are built for speed. I was like, I thought so too, but my roommate got sick of me rearranging the house. <laughs> That always works in crowds where people know what speed I'm talking about. <laughs> well, I'll end with this one. Um, anybody here uh, first? Is that the word? I know there are wines. I know the wine, different kind of wines. I like, uh, I like to be around those kind of people too because I, I like to fuck with them. They'll say, yeah, I like the, the Northern California Pinots, whatever. And I'll say, oh yeah, well, I like the Filipino noir. <laughs> <laughs> they're like, I'm invited this free time. Like, what? I got it at the cleft palace. <laughs> Again. <laughs> All right, yeah, you can clap. 